Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm Gaynor. I'm Sophie. And today we're going to do a little bit more of Theo Vaughn. I'm going to do his funniest moments. Yes. So we did one, one, um, it was a, a while, while ago, ago we did. Yeah. Um, but Aiden, we're... Aiden introduced us to him, didn't he? Yes, he did, yeah. Um, I've, I think I heard of him before that, but I've never like Seen actually him. watched anything that yeah. he does. Um, but I think when we put the first video out, a lot of people were saying there's better. Yeah. Um, like compilations and videos out there so even though it isn't here today yeah. to give us his input we thought we'll, we'll have a go yeah. we'll try and yeah. um, so this is Theo Vaughn um, funniest moment so hopefully this is quite a good one um, and yeah should yeah. we get straight into it yeah and I was making like a nice smoothie and I'm fucking coked up I'm partying you know mm. I'm living high on the hog Word. two vests on maybe right and I thought I, <laughs> dude, I thought I heard something outside right which is kind of weird to even think of when you have a blender going, right? So I leave out of my apartment to go in the hallway, lock myself out with the blender going. <laughs> Two thirty in the morning, coked up out of my brain, right? <laughs> now I have to go to my landlord, dude, uh, who lives right down the hall, oh no. and tell him like, "Hey, man." Two thirty in the morning. I got locked out. Locked and the blender's out and on, the blender's son. Going. Oh my god, he must have hated you. Oh, the blender shorts out and smoke happens. The fire uh, <sighs> alarm starts going off in the building right as I'm at his door knocking, right? Oh, my God. So now he's pissed, and he's like, what's going on? And I didn't know what to say. I told him that I was throwing a late Christmas party, dude. <laughs> it was fucking <laughs> end of January. How old were you at the time? <laughs> huh? Oh, this is two and a half years ago. So I was 35. <laughs> I was 35. <laughs> Bro. So he so, comes back to my apartment, right? He's fucking uh, pissed. He unlocks the door. There's nobody in there. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! I'm like man, but that's it. It was fun. <laughs> oh my god! <sighs> that was fun. How long did you live there for? I still live there. <laughs> Whoa! Yeah, we've passed. I mean, we kind of. <laughs> You know, like I've caught him doing some things. So I, think, I, think, I think we're all even. <laughs> also, I'm drinking like monster energy drinks sometimes, which are like piss magnets. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. They're delicious, but they make you want to pee. Make you want to beat your wife, too, dude. I've seen a <laughs> lot of dudes drinking monster that you know they're going home to punch. <laughs> I drink monster. <laughs> I don't know if the monster is the cause of it. I think there's probably other other factors. Well, I'll say this. It's the beverage of choice of some of those gentlemen. <laughs> I'll say that. Dude, we had two. owl two Thanksgivings ago. We had two owls at my sister's house. Yeah, I saw one last night, actually. Did you? Yeah, it was pretty. No, not last night. Night before last. It was pretty fucking cool. Pulled into the driveway and an owl took off. It was big, too. It's gross, I think. Owls? The meat, the f uh, oh, you ate them. You saying? Yeah, but the you guys ate owls. I you meant, yeah, I, I think that's legal. Yeah. I shouldn't say that on the podcast. I thought he meant just like because you know pets for the day, like yeah. oh, you know, yeah. kids look at the yeah, owl. I thought he'd seen. He was out somewhere and he'd seen them. Yeah, I've never heard anybody eat an owl. <laughs> what the hell does that taste like? Oh, do you know what I was just gonna say, what does it taste like? If you've eaten Ew. an owl, let us know it, what it's close to. Is yeah. it like chicken or is it like? I feel though like any any animal. Like people eat, they're always like, tastes like chicken. Yeah, everybody <laughs> says chicken. Mm -hmm. But um, I don't know if I will. Yeah, mm. let us know if you've yeah, ever tried they say it. There's, there's some birds that like, um, like pheasant. Bit that gamey. The, the, yeah, the meat's quite dark. It's not like chicken. No, that's what. It's a lot yeah. Stronger tasting. And I have a feeling owl might be like a dark meat. Yeah. You know, like a more gamey meat. Yeah, I don't I know. think so as well. We've never had tried it, so I don't I know. I would never try it either, like, just but... because it's an owl. Yeah. <laughs> never heard of that before. <laughs> I'm going back a bit. But the... You guys ate owls? Yeah. I don't I... think that's legal. You probably shouldn't say that on the podcast. <laughs> well... If you were a kid, okay, and you heard that Rocky song... Mm -hmm. Da 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 da. You could run faster. Oh, you. You would get more fired up. You'd be able to do more push-ups or Punch more chin-ups. Punch your fucking stepdad. <laughs> no, I'm saying you do it, yeah, but you will probably a lot of dudes. <laughs> probably, dude. I remember being at the library when I was young, and this is back when they had um, books. You know. What do they have now? I mean, you don't, I mean, I don't even fucking know. Our library's still open. Who's in there? Just people trying to finger each other. <laughs> <laughs> Who's in a fucking library? <laughs> Can you even imagine? <laughs> I guess being people in a library? just want books. Yeah, but still what about not. homeless people? Is it, are they allow homeless people in libraries? Yeah, can we just start calling them shelters? So. You know what I'm saying? Mm. And serve lunch. 
And dude, we used to, sh you know, good dude. We used to fucking go, you know, I remember driving to the Taco Bell and fucking doing steroids in the car, bro. We used to fucking, <laughs> you know what I'm saying, bro? <laughs> Taco Bell parking lot? Dog, I'd do 50 mLs just to fucking put really? down, a, oh, to put down a fucking Mexican pizza sauce. Wow, go. you were ready to get jacked. So I'm climbing right out of the Damn. sauna. See all the ice in there? So yeah. it's me coming. I worked out and then I went, and they usually do this. So look at this chunk of ice. See that shit? I usually do this yeah. right after cardio. So this is like a cardio session. Wow, okay. dude. Yeah. You look like one of those turkeys when they tie it up and it gets all like kind of like lined out. What? You know what I'm talking about? When they put that <clears throat> rope around that uh the ham and it's got oh. all the fucking Oh my six pack. Yeah. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Cold looking out, son. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah it is, bro. <laughs> I didn't know what that end game could be like, baby. That's freaking wild, dude. Congratulations, man. <laughs> Just keep working out, and you'll get there, too. That was in a race, but there was other times when you'd see him swim underwater, yeah. and he would gyrate his body <laughs> like a dolphin would. Yeah, weird as fuck, man. Yeah, man, I never wanted to be a fish, man, my whole life. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't. I didn't, man. Uh -uh. Whether or not this comedy thing was going to work out, I'm like, what am I doing? Yeah. Now I'm telling jokes? Jesus Christ. And yeah, and then telling people when you go back home and they've never seen you, they've never heard of you, they think you're gay. And if they're just like, you won't like, they're like, you keep flying home, you don't have any money, and you're right. not bringing a girl home. You're you have these from jokes. Something. Yeah, you're, you're hiding, hiding from, from something, something. You know? Yeah. Just come out. I remember my stepdad is yelling at me in the yard once. What are them creepy figures on the desk? I, do you know what? I will literally, I think I spaced out for a second there because I was just looking at the stuff on his desk, being like, what's he got on there? Yeah. I was looking like, at it all being like naked. <laughs> They're all facing forward. Oh yeah. <laughs> They're like the shorts. Weird. Yeah. Who knows? I don't know what that is. There's a very strange lamp that looks a bit like that thing off think, um, yeah. Jeepers Creepers. I was gonna say it looks like a um, nightmare on Elm Street or <laughs> <Yeah>. something. <laughs> Just some very random stuff. Yeah. <laughs> girl home you're you have these from jokes something. yeah you're, you're hiding, hiding from, from something, something. you know yeah. just come out i remember my stepdad is yelling at me in the yard one time I told you to come out yeah i was like i'm not fucking gay bro <laughs> i was like i'm just not flying some girl home that i just met you wow. know just to prove to he you thought guys he could catch you yeah. yeah. catch you to lie <laughs> yeah he thought maybe he was gonna leave a uh yeah like a, um, he's gonna set a trap yeah he's gonna set a trap yeah he was setting a trap yeah he's like a slick boxer yeah <laughs> <laughs> he set a trap for you. Just come out of the closet, boy. Like, what the fuck? Imagine if your grandma just shit all over your yawn. Just go out, go out on the lawn and just she shits in the yard, shits on the lawn. Like, oh, grandma's out there shit. I gotta go clean up her shit. Yeah, I love her, but God, I hate cleaning her shit. Yeah, I would hate cleaning up probably human shit for some reason. But I remember more than dog shit. Well, when I was a kid, they had a boy in our neighborhood named Mario, right? <laughs> And he, uh, and he was a dude, he ended up dying, actually. He did some pills and drove into an embankment. But he, when I was young, he would shit in his yard make me bury it. And that's how, <laughs> that's how I was allowed to be friends with him. Why, how did he make you bury it? He just asked me to do it, and I was afraid not to do it, I think. He said, hey, yo, dude, you're not going to believe this, but I took a shit, and um, it's out my yard. I can't even bury it because I'll throw up. Can you do me a favor and go bury it? Yeah. He was, he, dude, he was dark, man. He had a, he had a real dark vision and he would, uh, he would, I mean, he probably, honestly, dude, I, I was like, <laughs> he probably shit 200, 300 times and I buried it. No. I swear to God. Come on. I swear really? to God. I swear to God, dude. And he, um. How'd you not run out of places to make new holes? Did you think you ever dug up old shit to put in new shit? Oh, oh yeah. I wouldn't be surprised, man. It, <laughs> We basically had like the only setup I had, and I didn't even have a strong system. The only setup I had was like a one of those plastic, uh, you know, beach. Oh no! Like a beach yeah. setup, dude. How I'm talking. I was seven. There? So wait a minute. This seven year old was doing this. How old was he? He was eight or nine. Oh, he's tricking you by yeah. being older. Oh, wait. He was older, and two years Surely when you're seven is a long stretch. That's like the start of like a very troubled child. Yeah. Do you know what mental health illness? Yeah, like. That's, I've never heard of that before in my entire life. I've heard of some weird stories, but a kid that, that shits in the yard all yeah, the time. That, is that poo is outside old. and gets someone else, to, to hide it. a younger child, to bury it for that's it. Like, that's like people who uh, kill animals, isn't it? This is what I mean, it's like a slippery slope. Yeah, well, he's obviously he's dead now, so he's done something there that he shouldn't have been doing. Oh my gosh. <laughs> 
can you by yeah. being older? He was older. And two years when you're seven is a long stretch. You know, when you're 32, oh, yeah. 32, 34, that God. doesn't mean shit. Whatever, dude. Po- you, seven and nine, that's a big stretch. Yeah, you go shit at your house, buddy. That's what I tell people now. <laughs> but, so for two, what he would, sh- what was the, fr- do you remember the first? There's no way you really remember. I remember like, what 100%. he said. I don't remember what he said, but I remember. How did it happen? How did it happen where you find yourself with a plastic shovel and another person's shit going, damn, how did it come to this? Well, it came to it because he, I know my brother probably wasn't around and I wanted somebody to play with and he Mm. was older. So I was hanging out and he was deviant, man. How so? He just had a little bit of like, um, like he was kind of slithering. You know what I'm talking about? Mm. From, uh, he knew how to manipulate you. Yeah. He was obviously uh, buried his shit 200 plus times. (laughs) Like there wasn't, he had the same color in the outside of his eye and the inside of his eye. You know what I'm talking about? Demon. Yeah. Like a light a Diablo. Diablo. Yeah, like an El Diablo, but mm. also who was in elementary school. Oh, interesting. <laughs> wow. He's got some interesting stories. Very interesting stories. But I wonder what sort of a childhood he had. Because I know he, he talks about like all the drugs he takes. Yeah, so yeah. And anyway, the way he talks, you can tell that he's like, you know. I bet he's got. I bet he's definitely got a lot stories. of a lot of interesting stories. It'd be it'd be interesting to sort of sit down. You know, and they say like, oh, would you have a you know at a dinner table? Name you yeah. know five celebrities alive or dead. He'd definitely like have yeah. some good stories yeah. only for yeah. you. <laughs> but it, it amazes me how at that age you're allowed to just play out on your own and there's no kind of. Yeah. Parental, because I remember when I was seven, and that was like a lot longer before he was. I was never allowed to just play out on my own. I'd never, no, no, I was, I was never allowed like past the street, past yeah. the end of the street with, like, you know, like little you, like cul de sac, you shame cul de sac thing, and we weren't allowed past the end of the street. That was like, you know, your yeah. limit. Even then, I, I think we were only allowed where you know, yeah. your mum or dad could see, see you. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I was allowed to play out on the front. Yeah, but yeah. I wasn't allowed to move, I wasn't allowed to go to anybody else's house. No. Whereas he's Whereas like, he's clearly... Yeah, like in different people's gardens. <laughs> yeah. walking around burying. fields and burying... <laughs> <laughs> burying poo. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was, yeah, somewhat different than what I think yeah. we're, we're used to watching. Yeah. But, um, yeah, I quite enjoyed that. Yeah, it's I did as well, yeah. And, um, yeah, if you like to let us know, and um, we'll definitely do some more, especially when Aiden's back. Yeah. I'm sure he can teach us more about him. Yeah. And um, yeah, thank you so much for watching, and we will see you next time. Bye. Bye.